Hi, I'm going to read you one of my favourite stories and then I thought we could do some drawing. This is a book about a little boy who's going to buy a pet. Do you know what a pet is? It's an animal that you look after at home. Let's see what he gets up to. The Great Pet Sale. Everything must go! said the sign on the pet shop window. In the window was a rat. I looked at him. Half of his whiskers were missing. Oh, I'm a bargain, called the rat through the glass. I'm only one P. Choose me. Here he is under here. Inside the shop, there was a tiny terrapin for two pence, a turtle for three pence, and a tortoise, a great big one for four pence. I'm sure you wouldn't like one of those, said the rat, but you'd like me. Here he is here. You really would. This poor little rat really wants to be bought, doesn't he? On the perch were things beginning with P. A pelican, a puffin, a penguin and a parrot. And underneath here, a platypus, all five pence each. Oh, you don't want anything beginning with pa, said the rat. Ra, ra, ra is what you want. Ra for ratty. Behind a plastic rock was a salamander for six pence, a skink for seven pence and a gecko for eight pence. Which one is which? I said. Nobody knows. Nobody cares, said the rat. Sausages on legs. You don't want one of those. This is my favourite bit in the book. That's funny. Sausages on legs. The next two animals were 9p the pair. Who wants a koala that doesn't like leaves, said the rat, or an anteater that won't eat its ant? I'm not fussy. I'll eat anything. What's happened here? Maybe he's eaten a bit of this book. In the cardboard box were assorted little brown creatures, ten pence the lot. Boring, 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 said the rat. I'm not boring. Look, I can stand on one leg. And it did. All these little creatures inside. back of the shop we came to a big door. What's in there? I said. Oh just a dragon, said the rat. There's no such thing, I said. Well then you won't want one, will you? said the rat. I opened the door. It was a dragon, a great big Komodo dragon for 25 pence. At last the rat was quiet. You're not going to choose me, are you? It said sadly. Shh, I said. I've made up my mind. What's he going to choose? What's he going to buy? I counted out my money. One pound exactly. That's a hundred pennies. It was just enough to buy the rat and everything else in the shop. Look at them all. That's such a brilliant story, isn't it? Go back and listen to it again if you want to. But I thought what we'd do now is use your imagination and think about a pet that you would like to draw. So close your eyes and imagine a pet that you would like to own. I'm thinking of one now. Is your pet going to have big ears or little ears? Is your pet going to have a long tail or a bushy tail? I'm thinking now about the type of pet that I would like to own. Hmm. I'm just going to start drawing. You start drawing too.
my pet's going to have small ears? Is yours having floppy ears or big sticky up ears? And what kind of a nose is your pet going to have? Is it going to have a sticky out nose or a little tiny nose? Oh, mine's going to have whiskers. And as I'm thinking about pets, I'm remembering, I really love red pandas actually. Do you know what a red panda is? They're a bit like a raccoon and a bit like a kind of fat cat. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to try and draw one of those. The thing I like about red pandas is they have a really big bushy tail. So this pet I'm making up is going to have, look, enormous bushy tail. And it's got to be striped. I always like pets that have stripy tails for some reason. How are you getting on with your drawing? If you've got pencil crayons you can obviously colour yours in as well. What I love about red pandas they are this lovely sort of dark gingery browny reddy colour so I might do that afterwards. Is your pet going to be a bit frightening or is it going to be a sort of nice soft pet? I think mine is looking a bit cuddly actually. He doesn't look very frightening at all. <laughs> Here's mine. I wonder what yours looks like. Here's my pet that I would like to come and live in my home with me. When you've done your drawing, you could colour it in or you could draw a little friend for your pet or you could draw yourself with your pet. Maybe you could draw yourself and your pet going somewhere together or doing something together. Have fun anyway.